So police say they have now cracked the case of three bold armed robberies. Some of the suspects in these crimes aren't even old enough to drive. Steve Kiggins is in Everett with the incredible charges. Cops say it was surveillance video that helped them identify one 12 year old. That young man is accused of using a handgun to hold up a convenience store and a coffee shop just up the street from here. This masked armed robber isn't even old enough to have a Facebook account. Watch as the 12 year old suspect points his pistol at the clerk at Pex Drive Market in Everett on August 28th. The boy tosses a plastic bag onto the counter and demands money from the till. Then, less than a week later, investigators say the prepubescent punk held up the hillbilly hotties coffee stand on Hoyt Avenue. He rode up on his bicycle, uh, ordered some coffee. At 12 years old, he ordered coffee. Uh, when the uh, when the victim in this case actually told him how much it was, he reached into his backpack and pulled out the firearm at that point in time, demanded the money. According to cops, the barista told the boy they didn't have any money, so the kid took his drink, grabbed their tip jar, and rode off on his bike. Any time that you know you go out and commit a crime with a firearm, that's pretty serious stuff. Surveillance video helped cops catch up with the kid, and they believe he got the gun from another youngster, this guy who's caught on tape in late July robbing a. Jimmy John's with a child who hasn't been identified. And we we're actually able to identify another male who robbed the Jimmy John's, and he's a 16 year old Arlington man. I was ready to make a sandwich for somebody, and turns out they didn't want a sandwich. When the manager opened the register, the boys grabbed the cash and took off running. Tasha Hodges witnessed the robbery. She can't believe kids would risk so much for so little. It's some change when you get right down to it, like your whole life is gone because you made a really bad decision at a really young age. Cops say the same weapon was used in all. All three burglaries, both boys are under arrest and have confessed to committing the crimes. Very troubling. It's not a good, not a good situation. Um, obviously, we're, we're real happy with the police work. Now, cops still aren't sure where that gun came from in the first place, and they're still on the lookout for that second kid involved in that Jimmy John's robbery. Investigators hope to make an arrest in the next few days. In Everett, Steve Kiggins, Q13 Fox News.